Hi coders! In this tutorial, we are going to learn about the optical distance sensors on your Tetrix PushBot. The PushBot has three optical distance sensors assembled on its front. The two outer sensors face downwards, and the middle sensor faces forward. All three optical distance sensors emit light from an LED and measure the amount of reflected light. Here, you can see all three of the sensors displaying their raw values in the heads-up display, or HUD for short. The front optical distance sensor returns a raw value of zero because it is too far away from any object that can reflect light directly into it. When the amount of detected light for a sensor is high, the sensors display a high value. A lighter surface reflects a higher raw value than a darker one. Different colors also reflect different amounts of light, and thus return different sensor values. We can take advantage of the differences in color on the parking lot floor when coding. For example, if we wanted the robot to stop on a white spot or line on the floor, and we knew that any white surface returns a sensor value greater than 250, we could design a program like this. While the ODS light value is lower than 250, drive forward. Once the ODS value reaches or exceeds 250, stop the robot. Here, the robot drives forward as long as the value detected by the right optical distance sensor is less than 250. If the sensor value increases to 250 or beyond, the robot stops. Try to use the other two optical distance sensors when coding. Can you use them to create a more efficient and powerful program? Thanks for watching and keep on coding.